absolutely. 30.52, a very tough time to beat. There is a good chance that that will hold. We have not, we have only seen one sub 30 second run this whole day. Ian Marco Caban, 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 I'm assuming it's Caban, Caban, was first overall in Southeast points. A very strong ninja. And like so many, he has migrated over to SoFlo Ninja Academy. The new facility that's just opened up. How he just caught that, kept his legs up straight forward. 27.72. Immediately, grief. as I said, that sub 30 was going to be tough. Ian Marco just proves me wrong. Beating that is the second 27 we've seen today after Lily Barrett. And it certainly worked out for Lily. Ian Marco Caban is back at the starting line for his rerun. Here goes Ian Marco. At long last, the actual final runner. Well, I mean, he was the final runner all along, but this will be the final run, barring an act of God. On the skyhooks, very smoothly through. Wyatt Herman currently waiting on the bubble to see if Ian Marco will knock him out. Ian Marco with a great dismount there. Popping right on up into the kaleidoscope. Knows what he has to do. If he wants to comfortably qualify for the finals, he's got to beat a minute 45 seconds, putting him ahead of Cameron Godbout. Because we still do not have an official ruling on Luke Frateroli's time. He's so going, anything, He's going for the pause technique. He's going for the boats. He's going for the big move, That's it and he gets around. the big move. Oh, my goodness. Hold everything. He might come in first. This is absolutely insane. You know what? That's a move that he missed on his first run as well. Goes That's to show correct. how much that extra practice, that extra experience on the obstacle is helping him. Pops right up. Turns around. He's going to have to he going right for the distance? backwards. No, he's going to okay. pop up. Yeah, get a That's nice high smart. grab. That's smart. He... I, I still don't understand how Charlie Ball finished. Oh in my goodness! A minute sixteen. But Ian Either Marco way, Caban, by the way, just had the greatest finish time in the history of the World Ninja League. Literally at one two three four five. Wow, zero one two three four five. Yeah. But Ian Marco Caban finishing in second after all that, unfortunately knocking out Wyatt Herman. And that does mean it puts Cameron Godbout on the bubble now. Ian Marco will join Charlie Ball and Benjamin Perino in the finals. But it's going to be either Cameron Godbout or Luke Frateroli clinching that last spot.